Hi guys, as you see, we don't have a new project for today because we are gonna open a file and we are gonna learn a new selection tools. Let's start. Let's go with the open. We are gonna use this curl for today. And let's start. Today we are going to learn these tools, these three tools for selection. And actually these three tools is more advanced than these two tools. So let's go uh, with Lasso tool. Let's start with Lasso tool. What's Lasso tool? Lasso tool actually one of the advanced selection tools in Photoshop but we have more advanced tools like object selection tool or quick selection tool and magic wand tool uh, but today we are gonna learn lasso tool so let's go with that with lasso tool you can draw your selection just left click and hold the click hold your click as you see and just we can do it something like that it's not a professional as you see because lasso tool is not most advanced tool for the selection in photoshop but it's a good tool actually and you can use it somewhere. As you see, we have some selections in here. So, since our selection is not perfect, let's make it perfect, but not with the selection tool, with options for the selection tool. How do we do it? Just right click and select and mask. We are gonna go with feather and select inverse later. Let's unselect and mask. Yeah, as you see, we can't see anything in here. Uh, we can do something like that on a black, let's say. And we have something we don't like, right? It's not mm, perfect. Okay, and let's perfect it. Let's make it perfect. First, we are gonna use Refine Edge or Brush Tool. Let's use Brush and let's just make it bigger. As you see, as you see, it's adding more selection area. We need to Delete it. Delete the selection area. Yeah, it's okay. And something like that. As you see, uh, we we just make it mess, and we don't need that mess actually. As you see here, we have mess. We have mess in here. So, that's hard, right? Uh, yeah, that's actually really, really hard. And you can do something like that. But you can do something like that, as you see. This is more advanced Refine Edge Brush Tool, actually. And let's make it a little bit. But as you can see, we have we still have a problem in here. So what do we do? Actually, we have radius, radius for that. You can change your radius, but it doesn't matter 
how much you can change it or how much you, how much you can smooth it or how much feather you can give it to, to it. because you need a perfect selection for your perfect works let's see if that works with the feather let's okay no it's not working as you see see it's not working so what do we do here uh, since we have something like that with lasso tool let's go with another and more advanced tool it's polygonal lasso tool with polygonal lasso tool we have one option to make you can draw it but not with your hand you can take points you can make points just left click and make your first point then left click every time that you want to make a point and as you see I didn't choose the hair in here here and now what I'm what I'm gonna do I'm gonna just backspace click backspace on the keyboard or delete you can do both of them and as you see it just erased my point and I can make new points but I can't give curve with polygonal lasso tool and I need curve because it's a girl and we are working on the head of a girl our selection is more advanced but not perfect again let's see as you see but we have some white area in here in here and if you want to see it that's let's just as you see on black we can see here and something here and look at that what's that do you see it it's not perfect actually do you see it it's not perfect again look at that face it's not perfect yeah in that case we have more advanced tools for the selection but today we are gonna learn three tools okay let's go with that three tools cancel and control D again and our last tool is magnetic lasso tool magnetic lasso tool is like polygonal lasso tool but it make it by itself what do I mean let's click uh, of our very first point in here and go with the side of the girl and it's gonna make it on its own it's more of more free tool actually yeah uh, you can change it you can mm, delete your point with the backspace uh, or you can do it more accurately but and you can even make points with clicking again uh, you can click it, click it by yourself uh, but it's not actually way to choose way to choose way to select with no harm or uh, with perfect angle as you see as you see 
yeah and clicked again as you see it's on it's not a perfect way to choose something yep since it's not perfect we should learn how to do it perfectly and we are gonna learn it in our next lesson and for today's lesson I'm gonna give you some examples some attachments for this lesson that you can practice okay that's it for today thank you for joining